Hi everyone, welcome to Tech by Binance. In this video, I will show you how to transfer money from Binance to Active Cash and also how to transfer money from Active Cash to Binance. We are going to be doing all this using Binance peer to peer. So without wasting much of your time, let's get started. So the first thing you need to do is log in into your Binance account and your Active Cash account, which I've done over here. Yeah, here is my Binance account and here is my Active Cash account. Then here in Binance, you need to come over wallet and then come and press on overview. So you can see over here that I've got about $12 on my Binance account. So we are going to be sending this money to Adiv Cash. So to do that, the first thing that you need to do, you have to make sure that uh, this money, you can see over here that it is in Fiat and Spot. So you have to move this money from Fiat and Spot to your funding wallet. You can only use your funding wallet when transferring money in Binance P2P. So we are going to move this money from fiat to funding and to do that you just need to come and press on transfer then here you need to come and press on this one and then you need to come and press on e funding so here i'll just move the entire amount by pressing on max i just need to come and press on confirm once the money has been transferred from fiat and spot to your funding wallet all what you need to do is to come and press over here then you come and press on e p2p trading over here you can see that we have got two options the buying option and the selling option so for us we are going to be selling our usdt in exchange we are going to be receiving the money on our active cash account so if you want to transfer money from binance to your active cash account what you're going to be doing is to sell your usdt or any other cryptocurrency on binance you can see there's btc BUSD, BNB, like we have got Ethereum, DAI, and Shiba In. So for us, it is USDT, and we are selling it. So I, I just need to come and press on it, sell. And then you need to come under fiat and come and choose the currency. So in our case, we are looking for USD. So you need to come and put USD in here. Then after that, you need to come under payment and come and press on it. Then you need to search for additive cash in here. Then you just need to come and press on active cash. Once you put your payment method, you are going to have a long list of people who are available like for trading. So you just need to choose the person based on the like completion rate. You can just check the number of orders the person has done, the completion rate, and also you can see the limit range. Like you can see this person only transacts between $500 and $3,000. So you have to go like within your range. So in my case, I can go with the second person. You can see that he has got a good completion rate of 96% and he has got a trading limit of $10 to 118. So all what you need to do is to come and press on sell USDT. Then over here, you'll be able to see the estimated time this transaction is going to take. So you just need to come over here and come and enter the amount in here. In our case, I'll just enter the entire amount. So I'll just press on all. So like you can see that it will be selling 11.98 on Binance and we're going to be receiving 12.01 on our like active cash account. Once you have entered the amount, all what you need to do is to scroll down. Then you come and see where it says payment method. You need to come and press on it and then choose the payment method. You can see like I've got perfect money and active cash. If you, do, if, you, if you haven't added any payment method, it's going to be empty what you need to do is come and press on set payment method and then add additive cash as payment method in binance you just need to add your additive cash email in here so for me i already added it i just need to come and press on additive cash then after that i just need to come and press on sell usdt once again so after pressing sell usdt you are going to have got one active order like the order is going to be created so all what you need to do is to wait for your peer to send it. Like in, for me, in my case, it is $12 to my active cash account. Like you're going to see the amount over here. You just need to wait for your peer to send this money to your active cash account. Once you receive the money, all what you need to do is to come to Binance and confirm that you have received the money. So I've received a message notifying me that the peer has sent the money. So what I need to do is to go to my active cash account to go and check if I've really received the money. So all what I need to do is to come uh, to my active cash account. Then here you need to refresh. Uh, you can see that my balance now is around $12. And when I scroll down, 
you can see that just now like this entry i received 12.01 which is the same amount like the peer was supposed to send this amount and he has sent 12.01 to my active cash account so now that i've confirmed that this person has sent money to me or what i need to do is to come back to binance then here in binance i need to come and press on payment received then you just need to come and press on the second option then you need to request for a verification code via sms and you can do that by simply pressing on get code immediately after entering the confirmation code the order is going to be marked complete you can see that the order has been completed successfully so we have been able to send money from our Binance account to our Adiv Cash account successfully. Now at this time, allow me to show you how to transfer money from your Adiv Cash account to your Binance account. We are also going to be using Binance peer-to-peer. -peer. So all what you need to do is to come over here where it says buy crypto and then you come and press on Binance P2P. What we are doing this time around is buying USDT on Binance using our Adiv Cash balance. So among these two options, we are going to maintain the buy option. Then you need to do the same. You need to come and change the currency in here to USD. Then after that, you need to come and press on payment methods and search for Adiv Cash. Then over here, you just need to look for someone who has got a trading limit, which is within your range. You can see like with this person, the second person, you know, he has got a limit of $10 to $600. So I can go with this person and just need to come and press on it, buy USDT. Over here, you'll be able to see the estimate of time this transaction might take. Then all what you need to do is to come and enter the amount in here. So in my case, I want to deposit about how much I've got 12.20 on my active cash account. So I'll be depositing the entire amount. I just need to come and press here and come and enter the amount 12.20. So, like this is the amount of money I want to deposit to my Binance account using Adiv Cash. And I'm going to be receiving 12.07 on my Binance account. After entering the amount, all what you need to do is to come and press on it, buy USDT. Immediately after pressing buy USDT, we are going to have got one active order. So, all what we need to do is to come over here. So, we need to send... 12.20 to this person over here. You can see the name over here, like the full name, then the email address, and the Adiv Cash wallet ID. Uh, here on Adiv Cash, what we need to do is to come and press on e, send funds. So transferring money from one Adiv Cash account to another Adiv Cash account is absolutely free on Adiv Cash. So all what you need to do is to come and enter the amount in here. In my case, it is 12.2. Then after that, all what you need to do is to come and enter the person's email address in here or the wallet ID. After entering the wallet ID or email address in here, all what you need to do is to come and press on e, continue. Then all what you need to do is to go to your email to go and confirm this transfer. Uh, here, you just need to come and scroll down. You need to check like the payment details. Like if all the details are accurate, then you just need to come and press on e, confirm. Then you'll be brought to this page saying that the transfer was successful. So all what you need to do is to go back here in Adiv Cash. You just need to come and press on continue. Then you come and press on confirm once again. So you can see that the funds have been sent successfully. So all what you need to do is to come back to your Binance account. Then here in Binance, you need to come and scroll down and come and press on e, notify Sarah. Then here, you just need to come and tick this one and come and press on e, confirm payment. Just confirming that you have sent the money. This way, the seller is going to be notified that you have sent the money to their active cash account. So you can see that the seller has released the cryptocurrency and this order has been marked completed. And we have been able to receive 12.07 USDT on our Binance account. When you come to your wallet and come and press on e, overview, you will find that the account balance is twelve dollars, meaning that the seller has successfully released the USDT into our Binance account. So this is how you deposit and withdraw money from Binance using Adiv Cash. I hope this video was helpful to you. If it was, please do give it a thumbs up. And if you want more videos like this one from me in the future, make sure that you subscribe to the channel. For now, bye bye. See you in the next video.